Hello friends, in today's video we will learn about the difference between normal and quantum computers. These normal computers can also be called as classical computers which are mostly used nowadays by any common people. You might be aware of normal computer system which uses either 0 or 1 as binary system to perform its function and remains in a single state like 0 and 1, up or down and on and off. All these are known as bits. Information storage and manipulation is based on bits. Based on voltage or charge, low is 0 and high is 1. On the contrary, quantum computers depend upon phenomena of quantum mechanics such as superposition and entanglement with the possibility of remaining in more than one state at the same time. Quantum computers use qubits which can be 0 and 1 simultaneously, also known as quantum bits have far more faster, powerful processing power and can handle more complex problems. These quantum bits, also known as qubits, store quantum information in values between 0 and 1. Quantum computing is based on phenomena such as superposition entanglement and the possibility of being in multiple states at the same time. How much faster is quantum computer than a normal computer? As claimed by D-Wave to X machine, 100 million times faster than regular computer chip. In late 2019, Google claimed that it had managed to solve the problem within just 200 seconds using a quantum computer that would take 10,000 years for the world's fastest supercomputer. Knowing more about qubits, qubit is quantum information carrier having values of 0 or 1 or both can be together. Organized in a line can have 0 and 1 together. It represents block square that is the probability indicates amplitudes for superposition state when one substance is placed over another substance. This is all explained in this given equation when alpha and beta are probability amplitudes that is the possible dimension which are complex numbers. Qubit measurement can be explained with the help of Born rules quantum mechanics with the possibility of measurement of quantum system in easy way. Block space surface is two dimensional space. It represents pure qubit state and also its angles and degrees. Further, let's know how qubits are formed. Qubits can be photons, electrons, atoms or molecules and can be in two states such as spin up and spin down where spin up as 0 and spin down as 1 can be assumed for easy identification. Due to superposition, these qubits can stay together at the same time. By using power, photon path can be guided to form qubits. By using light and magnetic fields, Superposition, entanglement and other properties can be created. This concept is little hard to understand but necessary to understand quantum mechanics. Double slit experiment, its explanation through experiment was done by English physicist Thomas M in 1801, demonstrating the behavior of visible light. Young's double slit experiment was conducted with the aim of proving that structure of light resembles that of waves. This experiment helps people in understanding that electrons work like waves and create an interference pattern. Therefore, quantum computers are totally different from conventional computers. First quantum computer. First experimental demonstration of quantum algorithm was performed in 1998 by a team led by Isaac Chong of Los Alamos National Laboratory created the first quantum computer of two qubit that could be loaded with data and output a solution. These four and Max Planck are two founding fathers of quantum theory and each have received Nobel Prize in Physics for their work on quanta. Einstein is considered the third founder of quantum theory because in his theory of photoelectric effect he described light as quanta, for which he won Nobel Prize in 1921. There are top 10 quantum computing companies making change as per Forbes News. Several industry giants have established themselves as pioneers in this space. Google Quantum AI, Amazon, Microsoft, Intel, D-Wave, Quantinum, Rigiti, Zinadu, Atlas Quantum. IBM Quantum System 1 is first circuit based commercial quantum computer introduced by IBM in January 2019. Its current leader in quantum computing with its launch of Quantum System 2 powered by IBM made chip called Heron in December 4, 2023. Recently, IBM unveiled Condor, a 1,121 superconducting qubit quantum processor based on company's cross-resonance gate technology. 
and hopes to produce 1 lakh qubit quantum system by 2033. Google announced its quantum supremacy with its Sycamore quantum computer in 2019, which was able to perform a specific task faster than any classical computer. Google also aims to build a quantum system with 1 million qubits within a decade. Quantum computer related queries As you already know that quantum computers use qubits is a basic unit of memory also known as quantum bits. Higher number of qubits make quantum computers more powerful with more processing speed. However, more qubits give rise to more error rates due to interference. Quantum errors are more difficult to correct because of infinite number of states qubits can take. While still increasing the number of qubits is good, increasing the qubit quality is even more important. An error still occurs in one out of every 1000 operation. The error rate indicates how often qubit operations are successful. To tackle such error rates and make more reliable concept of quantum error correction, logical qubits come into play. Logical qubits are collection of physical qubits that address this problem which spread information from a single qubit across several qubits with possibility of detecting and correcting errors. More error-free quantum computing has been done by Australian researchers. Price of quantum computers. What is price of quantum computers? Can we buy one? Not until you have few million extra dollars which you do not require very much to fulfill basic needs. There is no doubt that this is most promising technology for modern times. SpinQ company, a startup company from China has released a commercial desktop quantum computer. As per Discovery News magazine, it costs less than $5,000. Its first generation product with 2 qubits was launched in January 2020. The Gemini Mini costs comes roughly 8,900 US dollars. Next question arises about the use of quantum computers. As already discussed, has a high potential in the field of business profitable best results can be attained after looking at its extraordinary processing power. After looking at its AI potential, we find it gives more accurate and faster data analysis. For example, Nasdaq makes use of AI, artificial intelligence, which finds out irregular activities in stock and also helps to fight against fraud and explore many more possibilities. It takes control and stops fraudulent activities before they can take place. And results are faster and reliable. One fault comes in quantum computers is requirement of cold environment because of delicate objects called quantum bits or qubits. Most qubits temperature must be cooled and operated within a few thousands of a degree of absolute zero to eliminate thermal cost and vibrations responsible for destruction of the information contained in the qubits. Therefore quantum computers typically operate at extremely low temperatures maintaining close to absolute zero about minus 459 degrees Fahrenheit. Some steps have been taken such that its infrastructure becomes smaller and cheaper and it should be capable of running at room temperature. Here are some of the 10 quantum computing applications. These are artificial intelligence, better batteries, cleaner fertilization, cyber security, drug development, electronic materials discovery, financial modeling, solar capture, traffic optimization and weather forecasting and climate change. NASA also used B-Wave processor quantum system for its space research, safe space exploration, military application, air traffic control, remote sending of robots as per mission. Unfortunately, this project was shut down after government intervention with possibility danger threat from AI intelligence than nuclear warheads. Will quantum computers replace normal computers? Answer is no, because quantum computers were not made to replace normal computers, even though quantum computers have given exceptional performance in such tasks in comparison to normal computers. Making of quantum computers is expensive and difficult, with few limitations when compared with classical computers. Therefore, there are many instances when normal computers have proved better in performance in comparison with quantum computers. There is a possibility that future computers will be combination of quantum and classical computers. Which gives the idea of hybrid quantum computing. Hope you found this video helpful and knowledgeable. Then do like and share this informative video and subscribe to this channel.